Now, with God's anointed word for you, here's Robert Tilton. This is great! This is exciting! Here we are, looking at you. You get to see me, but I can't see you. <laughs> see, I get so filled with the Holy Spirit and the Word of God in my, my heart that it begins just to bubble up. And when I'm talking to you, it just hits me. It just becomes like honey. It just begins to flow out of my being. And I just, I fall in love with hearing God speak to me through his word. And, and then it just gets in, even now, it's just like I'm being overwhelmed with the Holy Spirit of God. I love to speak to you and to encourage you and to sincerely help you. It's not fake. It's fake. It's not fake. I'm not fake. This is not fake. It's fake. Faith. Lord of God! in such a happy mood today. You see, my emotions are controlled and directed by the Spirit of God. I don't have to look at things as they are. Something wonderful has happened to me. All of a sudden, I've got supernatural eyesight. Eyesight that blinds me to the natural circumstances of life, and my eyes become opened to the promises of God. It's almost like radar vision or something, or x-ray vision, or radar vision, I don't know. Except every time I read this book here, this book, I bought it in a bookstore. Every time I start reading it, and I try to read it every year, every time I start reading it, I start getting wilder and wilder and wilder. It just does unusual things to me as I read this book. It's a strange book. It's got some type of hidden power on the inside of it. It just takes control of my life, and strength comes into my arms, and strength comes into my legs, and, and something happens to my brain, and I become spiritual-minded. All of a sudden, I begin to believe that things that were impossible are possible. Can you imagine being like that, walking around all the time, and everything is possible? Lord of God! That's my help! Psychedelic. <laughs> I've been called a lot of things, but it was a psychedelic. It was a it was psychedelic, psychedelic program. Uh, uh, Thank you, Jesus. Mm. Jesus! <laughs> Are you crazy? No, I'm not crazy. I'm just drunk on you. I'm telling you, I learned how to let go of the old and no longer trust in myself. I learned how to trust in God. Hallelujah. I used to drink wine. I used to drink lots of alcohol and do lots of drugs. But I'm telling you, I am so filled with this stuff. It's absolutely, just absolutely beyond all that I ever thought even existed in God. You have chosen to look beyond your own means and to look to my riches and glory. Yes, you chose to make a vow of faith toward me, believing that I would help you in the day of your troubles, and I will meet thy needs 
Not according to your riches, but according to mine. Because you dared to believe and be a doer of my word and not a care only. Though the storms may rage around you, your house will not fall. Because you heard my word this day and you chose to be a doer of it. So rejoice. Oh, rejoice. For the showers of blessings are coming. Rejoice today, for doors that will close will begin to open before you. For you have chosen to believe my prophets, the word that I speak through them this day. So rejoice, for the day of miracles has begun in thy life. Oh, thank you, Jesus.